this is my first video um, entering the new year and what an eventful couple of weeks it's been I swear it feels like March already so many things have been going on uh, but this video is while I'm stuck in an enormous amount of traffic I decided to record this this video is going to be about um, making Poshmark ambassador so woohoo I made Poshmark ambassador and there are some qualifications that you have to have uh, to meet with them to make Poshmark ambassador um, I met all of those qualifications fairly quick once I learned what they were um, for example uh, one of them is 5,000 self shares so sharing your closet or your items in your closet to uh, Facebook Twitter Pinterest uh, Instagram you know just sharing your things 5,000 times uh, I'm not going to go through all of them because I do not remember them by heart um, sharing other persons things as well uh, you have to share new postures things and the last thing that I had to do to meet the requirement was to leave a love note and in order to leave a love note you have to purchase something from someone on Poshmark and leave a love note <coughs> excuse me so after I purchased made my purchase I left a genuine love note because the lady she sent me uh, I purchased a Kashyyyk bra excuse me I purchased a bra and um, the lady uh, I don't know if she knitted it for me but she had a, a hand knitting, knitted scarf and she included it as like a free gift hold on you guys <coughs> my goodness I had like a little tickle in my throat the weather is like cold I mean like hot it keeps getting hot and it was cold yesterday and it was like 78 the day before so I keep playing with the air so <coughs> I'm sorry all right so um she had sent it she sent me a knitted uh scarf to go with it or whatever and I genuinely appreciated that so I left her a love note and I meant it so like a day after I sent the love note uh, Poshmark sent me something saying hey you um, you qualify for Posh ambassador status uh, click this uh, I think it was an invite and I clicked the invite and after I did that I was able to agree to the terms and conditions of becoming a Posh ambassador okay so um, like I told you guys before I follow a lot of other people on uh, Instagram and um, YouTube who also are currently going through the same status change like I am or they've already met their posh ambassador status <clears throat> and they uh, give advice so a lot of people they're saying totally different things so um, I was saying that when you go through the the status change there's been so many different experiences that people say they experience according to a lot of people that I follow on YouTube and I don't understand how people say that they experience different things but now that I just said that I think I know why people experience different things because people run their businesses differently some people don't believe in sharing anything some people don't believe in following others you know it's it's some um you know mechanisms that some people don't use that others do use so having said that let me express to you what has been happening so immediately upon uh, reaching posh, posh ambassador status um, I started getting all the new followers and generally everyone says this they get all the new followers that that just joined Poshmark and which is a really good thing to me some people don't like it but it's really good to me because those are the people that are on there solely just to look for things to buy which I like so did my sales increase yes um, I went from one week I didn't have any sales which was last week and I don't like it when I don't go to the post office 
you guys follow me at Astra's Closet, it's Astra's underscore closet on Instagram. I usually post when I'm going to the post office. You know, I show you guys what I'm posting and everything like that, what I'm shipping out. So, um, sales increased so far this week. I had uh, a few more sales than last week, which is really good. So, I'm going to work on my inventory. Tonight is Friday. I'm going to work on my inventory um, and decipher what all I'm going to post, you know, this weekend and next week. Because now that I know that things are picking up because I have more followers, I have more new followers, I can go ahead and finish posting some things that I thought I wasn't going to originally sell. So that's very helpful to get all the new postures, you know, in. And my followers have increased about a thousand followers a week now. So it's going up. I like that. I also am still attending all of the parties. Um, even if I'm at work or I take a bathroom break, I still jump in on a party. You know, I look at my phone and I, I get to relisting and, you know, posting my things in there. I do that. And um, <clears throat> the good thing about having a lot of new followers is that they're not really super familiar with Poshmark and they're not trying to lowball you. You know, some people that are super familiar with Poshmark and that also sell on Poshmark, they try to lowball you, you know, because they're a seller as well and they think that they're, you know, trying to work the system or whatever they think that they're doing. So I appreciate having new sellers. And like, you know, I had a, a young lady that sent me an offer and she, all right guys, I had to delete something out of my phone. I hate when that happens, but so I didn't mind her, um, you know, taking off a dollar. And you know, most people don't mind you taking off a small amount. But uh, I've noticed that new postures aren't really hard up to uh, try to lowball you. So that's also a good thing. And uh, that's about it. You know, I'm getting more followers. Uh, I've noticed my sales increase. And I am looking forward to um, subscribing to some other people because they follow Poshmark a little deeper than I do. They know when the Posh Fests are and things like that. So that's the next thing that I'm going to start working on is, you know, um, getting more acquainted with what's going on uh, a little deeper this year with Poshmark because I just... I just like being around people that think like I do. You know, everyone's here for a common goal. <clears throat> Most of us are here for a common goal, I should say. You know, to sell and resell and make money and, and run our own business and be entrepreneurs. So, thank you for uh, tuning in. I appreciate it. I thank you all. Um, happy New Year. And I look forward to learning more. And as I continue to learn more things about Poshmark, I'm definitely going to share it with you all. I'm on my way to my gig. So keep the hustle rolling. Peace, y'all.